already seen it. It's it's absolutely beautiful back here on uh, in Pennsylvania. I'm thinking Gretchen, Gretchen the Google Maps woman. She's trying to seduce me. <laughs> by driving and for whatever reason driving 290 uh, driving in PA stresses me out even yeah I heard you Gretchen get out of my ear hey there welcome to Jersey Jim fish fishmonger Jim here so that was a oh, I I guess you gathered from the title of this movie that we're fishing uh, spruce run I finally made it it's been uh, two hours and 20 minutes to get here and conditions are somewhat less than ideal. Yeah, they're somewhat less than ideal. Ooh. It's a bit windy. We have uh, a storm coming through. It was supposed to be tonight and all day tomorrow or late this afternoon and all day tomorrow. It's, uh, yeah, I don't know. I planned on launching in a different spot, but the spot, you know, you can't launch there. They got barriers up and I don't get it. I'm just popping my kayak in the water. It's kind of uh, pointless. It's a nice sheltered cove right here. I'm out exposed, <laughs> exposed, but I think I should be able to skirt the other shoreline there, but I am just gonna go ahead and wait until false sunrise so that I can make a, uh, a more a safer a safer plan go park my Jeep and drink my protein shake and rethink my life <laughs> well this might be a short trip the wind is supposed to get worse as uh, the morning progresses so get on the water now Let's see what we can do get out of the wind and have a, a plan of escaping the wind when it does get worse. Maybe that's the game plan. So I'm going to be starting off with the... So it's, uh, it's been like a half hour and it is, um, it's kind of sketchy already given this crusty old bastard kayak with the bent rudder. I'm, I'm not even a quarter mile away from the launch. But look at the screen. Look at the screen. All the puffy, pillowy weeds on the bottom. I like weed. Some suspended baits. Fish. I hate having absolutely no self-control. Because you know I'm going to have to stay here. You know I'm going to have to push my luck as far as possible. Well, yeah, look what I just discovered. There's a, uh, there's a proper boat launch on the other side of this peninsula. Yeah, the, uh, it's not. It's definitely doable on this side. A little bit windy, but you know, I can power through it, troll, stay in one spot. So all I got to do, all I got to do is get in the kayak and go around this point. And I'll be, I'll be out. I'll be out of the sketchy water and hopefully into some fish. Ooh, I got something. Ooh, I got something. Something big. It's not that big, but he's in the weeds. That right there is a. <clears throat> Spruce run largemouth bass, hell yeah. On the rage crawl. Just course here. Gonna eat bush in a second. Giggity. Okay, so I was I was able to get up the lake quite a bit. because uh, the wind died down. But now the wind is picking up again. I gotta go across the lake. If the wind changes direction or picks up much more. I mean, there, there's white caps there. Yeah, I'm scared. <laughs> that Round Valley experience was no joke. Subscribe to Jersey Jim Fish.
subscribe to Jersey Jim Fish. All right, say it again in case that one didn't work. Subscribe to Jersey Jim Fish. <laughs> subscribe to Jersey Jim Fish. Subscribe to Jersey Jim's Fish. Subscribe to Jersey Jim Fish on YouTube. See some good fish. <laughs> subscribe to Jersey Jim Fish. And don't forget to hit the like button on YouTube. All right, See you soon. Subscribe to Jersey Jim Fish. Fish. <laughs> okay, make sure you subscribe. Watch my buddy Jersey Jim on YouTube. He'll show you how to catch some good ones. Go ahead. Subscribe to Jersey Jim Fish because he catches the big ones. He catches the medium ones. You know, I don't catch the medium ones. And you don't get too many small ones. Jersey Jim is the best. He is the best. She called me Steph. Jersey Jim is the best. And I cannot bring myself to go through that again. All for potentially tangling with the fish. Yeah, it's getting pretty ugly over there. So, I mean, if it dies down again, I can always skirt the shoreline over there, but I am uh, really pressing my luck as it is supposed to pick up uh, considerably in the next couple of hours. Yep, so here we go. <laughs> oh, good God. Wow, oh, that was an unbelievably good call, Jim. If I was 10 more minutes, I would be... I'd be in a world of shit right now. Absolutely world of shit. <laughs> wow. I gotta stay away from reservoirs, I think. Absolutely no self-control. Of a, kind of a quick movie. My adventures here at uh, Spruce Run. Not exactly what I was expecting. Um, probably be back to Farrington to try to catch myself the uh, the elusive New Jersey Northern Pike. But that's about it. I uh, thank y'all for watching. Y'all, y'all have a wonderful day. Get the most out of each day, people. You never know when the last one's gonna come. Go fuck your hat. Bye. It's going to be a three hour drive to get home. You know, the, the, I'll get some footage of the, the landscape around here. It's absolutely gorgeous. Not what I'm used to in, uh, in the flat plains of South Jersey. There we go. It was an interesting day, just the same.
time. So this is very scenic. It's it's absolutely beautiful back here on uh, in Pennsylvania. I'm thinking Gretchen, Gretchen the Google Maps woman. She's trying to seduce me. <laughs> by driving and for whatever reason driving 290 uh, driving in PA stresses me out even yeah I heard you Gretchen get out of my ear